Hi everybody, and happy 4th to you. Mark made the comment that he wished I would make more vlogs, or would make more videos. Um, I think that's the case for everybody, really. I don't know why. It's just like, uh, people have gotten out of the YouTubing spirit, but then even that is an old conversation now. Um, last night, I went with my folks to see the fireworks, um, as per tradition, that Waukegan sets off down at the lakefront. And, I don't know, like for the past 10-15 years, we used to, because my dad and my older brothers and sisters used to play in the municipal band concert, that would be on July 4th down at the lake, so we would of course lay on the grass in our blankets and uh, at the lakefront and listen to the concert and then watch the fireworks and ooh and ah. But uh, for the past 10-15 years or so, maybe longer, because I keep forgetting how very old I am now, um, the thing is to park your car, not go all the way down to the lakefront because it gets very crowded and it's like hell to try and get home before midnight with all of the pede pedestrians and cars trying to uh, make their way from the lakefront back to their home. So the new thing is to park out on the uh, expressway, Waukegan's Amstutz Expressway, the sort of infamous expressway that was supposed to hook us up to Milwaukee and Chicago but it ran out of money and so now it's the expressway to nowhere. Movie companies from Hollywood pay Waukegan every once in a while to use it in movies such as Batman and stuff like that so or the t television show um, Chicago Hope whenever they need oh Busby it's mosquito let's go whenever they need an expressway crash site or something that started with the movie The Wedding with Carol Burnett back in the 70s. They used it in that movie too. Anyway, so, as per the new tradition, we parked on the expressway to watch the fireworks. Rather hot, so, and it was mosquito-y, so fireworks started at 9.30. So, I had the ignition on. Busby was on my lap, of course, panting and drooling. So I had the ignition on so some air would come through the vents. Dad had the radio on as per usual, listening to patriotic music while we watched the fireworks. And the battery went dead. So here we are stuck on the expressway at 10 o'clock at night. Roadside assistance would not tow on a highway. I would not jump, give us a jump on the highway. They would only tow us. So I said, heck with that. Hang up from them, let's call my sister and brother-in-law, who live in town. Get them to come over and just give us a jump. So, they go to bed like at 9 o'clock, so we had to get them out of bed. <laughs> to come and give us a jump on the expressway, so we could get home. And then we got rerouted and stuck in some of the traffic. And one of the dumb traffic cops was, for some reason, routing people. Oh, look at the delphiniums was routing people into the train station parking lot, which was a dead end. And we all had to turn around and come back out again. So it was quite a drive and experience home. Yes, wasn't it Busby? Mosquitoes are bad in the shade. Of course, that's where Busby likes to stop because he hates the heat. So that was my July 4th firework experience. How was everybody else's? Did you have a good show? I know Squincy said on Facebook that hers got rained out. Billy said he wasn't uh, going to any, he was just going to watch his neighbor's illegal fireworks. Um, Antonio, I don't know if you guys know, but Antonio graduated from his uh, design 
college and has moved to Florida. He no longer lives in Puerto Rico. He's living with his boyfriend, significant other, in Florida. So he's had a lot of changes. I've been trying to get him to uh, vlog about it, and he said that he will. But, of course, I don't see any videos. But anyway. So I don't want to make this too long, and I'm getting chewed up by mosquitoes. So I hope everybody is having a great weekend, great holiday if you're celebrating. And I'll see you later, and make vlogs. Bye.